So what's it feel like, you know, 1987 High School All-American meeting in 1977 High School All-American West Philadelphia Speed Boys? Talk to me about the significance well, of this moment. I'm going to let the veterans speak, and then I'm going to speak after him. Well, the only thing I can say is it's great to see that uh, a young guy, you know, I, I say he's young, he's old, he's older man, he's a man now, to come you know, right after and see how things continue on going and his growth and the contribution he did, not just for the school and the community, but worldwide. You know, it's, that, that makes your heart feel good that they carry that kind of thing on and do some good things because he's not just a good ball player, but he's a good person. And that, that means a lot. That, that makes your heart feel good. It makes you feel uh, you're really proud of not just being a Philadelphia heritage, but just what kind of person he is. I mean, that, 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 that goes a long way. Yeah. I, that, I, I feel special. Appreciate that. I'm here. Well, you know, without him, it wouldn't be a Mike Monroe because he set the tone at West Philadelphia High School and uh, just took us to the next level to raise the bar for all of us speed boys throughout the years to really continue the growth of speed boy basketball and like you said to help the community help us bring the community back you know I started a barbershop I've been a barber for 22 years I have the barbershop ESPM here zone on 60th and Gerard and uh, I give back to the community a lot we give out free haircuts 200 t haircuts to the kids uh, we give out you know jackets and book bags to the kids so we kind of give back, like, you know, that's what we do. Speed boys for life, and, you know, we continue to Boys try to make life. it happen, you know. Speed boys for life.